and hello everyone welcome back to a new video so the other day I heard about this site called HackerRank it is quite a lot like a Code Wars but it's a little different and it has a few new challenges which I find quite interesting so I'm still at the beginner stage of HackerRank and um, I'm going to do everything for now in JavaScript until I get kind of the hang of it and more because when you look at the code here it's not quite the same as with you know code wars so that only means that I gotta get used to that so first off let's do this Alice and Bob each created one problem for HackRank a reviewer rates two challenges awarding points on a scale from 1 to 100 for three categories problem, clear, bleh, problem clarity originality and difficulty we define the rating for Alice challenge to be a, to be triplet A which is an array and the rating for Bob's challenge to be a triplet B which is also an array your task is to find out because so I'm just gonna give you what, I, uh, what it basically says we should compare array A and array B and basically if array at index 0 is more than B at index 0 then Alice is awarded one point otherwise if B at index 0, 1, 2 is bigger than A at index 0, 1, 2, then Bob is awarded one point. If the, like let's say these two, which are the same, if A and B at, in the middle, is the same, then no one receives a point. That's basically what we gotta do. Okay, and the constraints are just that, basically, it will be between 1 and 100. It will not, not be less than 1, and the points will not be more than 100. Sample input 5, 3, 5 is bigger than 3, so Alice gets a point. 6, 6, nobody gets a point. 7, 10, 10 is bigger than 7, that means, what's the other guy's name, Bob? Yeah, Bob gets a point. So how I thought we could maybe do it, is we can do this. Uh, we can actually keep that. Uh, let Bob equal 0, and let Alice equal 0. So now nobody has any points. Now we can create a for loop maybe, which will in turn to get everything from A and B and compare them. So for let i equal zero while i is less than a dot length i plus plus. Okay, then for let j equal zero. Ooh, that's minus equal zero while j is less than b dot length j plus plus it will actually kind of stay the same length as um, as uh, how can I say it it will kind of stay the same length it will always be free but you know it's always just good practice yeah. let's also call it um, compare triplets and then in array one which would be Alice we can put this okay 5 6 and 7 5 comma 6 comma 7 and then in this next array we can put 3 6 and 10 okay there we go so let's try and get the points we can also console.log this Okay, so if A at index I is, you know, I don't even actually need to do that. I can actually just create one for loop. If A at index I is more than B at index I, then we can say that Alice because that's more points and Alice is a Alice plus plus else if a at index i is less than b at index i then the bob plus plus okay and then else then nobody gets anything then it just continues actually we don't even need that we can just do that so only if it's like that 
and then it will return points uh, but we can do this uh, points equals Alice and then Bob okay now if we open this containing folder we select this, we close that we say node compare one one, so each of them have one point good, now let's make Alice free what will we get then? one two that is correct because six is bigger than three okay that was actually pretty easy I'm not gonna lie so let's see if we get it right if we paste it in here so we want to paste it here V okay run code okay and we passed it congratulations you passed it okay we get some better.